Uh, hello guys, uh, welcome to Nemtech channel. My name is Nehemiah and I'm very very much happy to have you on board. Now this is lesson 4 on NumPy and uh, we are going to discuss Seaborn module. But then uh, guys, uh, before we start, uh, please consider subscribing to the channel and uh, to the returning subscribers. I uh, thank you very much for your continued support. So guys, uh, first of all, let's understand what is a Seaborn uh, module. And I remember I told you uh, that uh, a module is like a code library. So a Seaborn, a Seaborn is, a, is, a, is, a, is a library that uses matplotlib underneath uh, to plot graphs. And it will be used to visualize a random distribution. Remember we discussed a random distribution in a previous uh, you know, a lecture. Uh, and so guys, uh, let me show you how to install the this uh, Seaborn uh, you know, module. But then uh, before you install it, ensure that you have installed uh, you know, Python on your device and also uh, the PIP. Now once you have installed uh, this uh, you know, Python in the PIP, then you can open your command prompt. You can open your command prompt, the, the CMD. And then you are going to type uh, PIP install, I'm sorry, install. Uh, install what? Install a Seaborn. Install a Seaborn. Uh, so install Seaborn, then you click what? You click on enter. And then again, uh, I uh, give it time to install the Seaborn. Uh, and so, guys, I think by now you have installed that Seaborn module. Now, let's discuss this plot in a few. Now, guys, uh, this plot uh, stands for distribution plot. It takes uh, it uh, it takes as input an array and the plots a curve corresponding to the distribution of points in the array. And so, guys, uh, let me show you how to import the matplotlib. Now, guys, uh, import the uh, pyplot object of the matplotlib module in your code using the uh, using this statement, guys. Uh, import uh, import matplotlib 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 like this dot uh, these are pyplot uh, more actually uh, these are pyplot object pi uh, plot and uh, pyplot is um pyplot actually let me say plt plt because i'm using it as an alias and then now guys uh, this is how we can do it this is how we can import it and then um guys uh, let me now show you how to import the how to import the you know this as uh, bone now guys i will import the seaborn module uh, in your code using this uh, statement also uh, just say import and then uh, the module itself which is seaborn c seaborn uh, uh, sorry seaborn uh, seaborn but you can use an as an alias uh, sns sns and then again uh, to plot that uh, this plot we are going to write this line of code S and S. Remember, we import Sibon as an alias. S and S. And now, this are uh, this plot. And this uh, pl actually this plot. Um, you know, this plot uh, object. Uh, we are going to type here this this plot. Uh, this plot. And then uh, we are going to type to type in our array list here. Perhaps let me say zero. One, two. Sorry, it should be two, three. For uh, five or uh, to six to six, and so guys, uh, let's uh, run these uh, codes at the terminal to show that a uh, graph. And then, uh, guys, you can see that it has done what it has plotted this uh, graph for us. And so, guys, uh, basically, this is how we can plot at uh, this plot. But then, uh, let me show you how to plot at uh, this plot without us uh, without the histogram. And now, guys, uh, to do that, uh, here. Uh, first of all, let me copy these lines of code again, so that I may use it in a, in a new cell. And then uh, in this uh, new cell gaze, I'm going to say what I'm going to um, uh, add another argument here. After this uh, array list here, I'm going to say hist, hist, uh, hist, then I'm going to assign it to. And then uh, here, guys, I'm going to give it a false. I'm going to give it a false. Then I guess uh, let me run these uh, codes at uh, the terminal. And then I guess you can see that uh, we have done what we have plotted. These are this plot without uh, the histogram. Uh, and so, guys, uh, basically, we shall be using SNS.dist uh, plot uh, into array argument and also these are uh, dist 
uh, hist, uh, and hist equals to false argument to visualize random distribution in our in our in these are tutorials but then again uh, basically this is what i wanted to show you about the seaborn module shall be discussing it as we go on but then uh, for now i want to end this video here and i think by now guys you have understood uh the seaborn module please consider subscribing to the channel like and share the video to your friends until next time this is nehemiah goodbye